Good afternoon. <laughs> so, hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Hadassa. If you do not know me, I'm sure you're like, um, why is she holding a box? So basically, I came up with this very cool idea one day when I was being chased by a stray dog in my area, and it's called a makeup box. And no, it's not a box filled with makeup. What my makeup box is about is. <laughs> Are you not ashamed of yourself? Are you not embarrassed? This is really embarrassing. Basically, each time I use the makeup box, there's going to be a group of names inside, a card of names. And whatever name I pick is a look that I'm going to recreate for the day. And today, today, I decided that I should do Ghanaian actresses, the Ghanaian actresses that I grew up seeing. And whichever name I pick, I'm going to recreate a look from any of their films. But wait! wait before you're like oh we say please i don't like makeup i beg you're not only going to watch me do my makeup i'm also going to be speaking about certain ghanaian habits superstitions or just all around behavior that either needs to stay or needs to go so i'm going to shake the box and when the cards scramble i'm going to close my eyes and pick one so we move okay Okay, I think the names are pretty scrambled now, so I'm about to open it, pick, and close my eyes. Okay, I'm manifesting who Yvonne Nelson. Does this is look I really love? Okay. Have I picked any? Okay, obviously not. <laughs> okay. If okay, I can feel the paper, I can feel it. Okay, I'll pick one. Wow, the wind was very much. I was trying to push out, and we were still taking me back. I'm happy because I never expected it. <laughs> sorry, sorry. I got Iwan Nelson. I got Iwan Nelson. Oh my gosh, guys. <laughs> okay. I'm really excited about Iwan Nelson because I want to do Princess Tyra. So, <laughs> let's get into it. We move. already started because i got really excited but as i said i'm doing princess tyra i'm going to put the look up here now we move so this is one of my i wholeheartedly believe in this because <laughs> i've seen it with my own eyes let me tell you so the first superstition that i applaud i think that yes it is true is that when you see money whether it is 50 pesos one cd 20 cds on the ground or on the floor you don't know who is for don't touch it run look at that bad day oh god jesus oh god jesus oh god jesus oh god jesus because <laughs> listen not only is it unsanitary you should just be picking money off the ground in your base you will turn into a yam how can you see money you don't know who is for you don't know it's for you you don't know if there's some bondage on it you go and pick it and then wake up and you see that you are young in makola market you're asking yourself how did i get here where's my family how am i young sweetie how do you touch someone's money and then you are shocked that you have turned into a young let me tell you guys a story if you don't believe me so one day in east Legon, i was walking with my childhood best friend let's call him antony antony and i were walking 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 and then, ah, Antonio wanted farm pop, okay? He wanted farm pop, but he didn't have money on him. And then he sees five CDs on the ground. At that time, it was, what, 5,000? I don't know. But he sees the equivalent of five CDs on the ground. Antonio reaches out. I'm like, Antonio, Antonio, don't pick it up. And Antonio's like, oh, ah, means like, I want farm pop. He picks it. Antonio didn't turn into a yam, do. He turned into a cockerel. I don't know if you can hear the cockerel in the back. That's Antonio, because we've had to keep him in my house. <laughs> hey! What would 
you do if you saw like 10 million dollars <laughs> on the ground <laughs> were you going to pick it what's this talk about were you going to pick it comment and let me know but, yeah, but for the second thing i would say like a general behavior would be being too judgmental but i'm going to use this particular example can you hear antonio you cannot be calling girls you see wearing anklets prostitutes how hey, I, I was all right Ow. you can't be calling people prostitutes like you can't see a girl and she's wearing an ankle and you're like oh she's a prostitute she's not she doesn't come from a good home it is a piece of jewelry <laughs> meant to be worn on your foot i don't even know where that prostitute thing comes from that's number one number two calling someone a prostitute and treating the word prostitute as an insult there's a lot to unpack why are you likening someone to a system that allows women to be exploited to be harmed you yourself what have you done to help girls that are trafficked into prostitution like do you speak about it do you care about it and even aside from that it's not always the case i don't know if sex workers and use prostitute as a synonym that's something that i'm gonna have to read up on but you are basically just bringing up that notion of oh yeah you should be ashamed like about having sexual agency and why would you want to be a sexual woman and like just uh, basically stop acting like we are 1832 it is 2020 nobody can seize our fundamental woman rights what a, they are wear a piece of jewelry and just in general just profiling people because oh they have a piercing oh they have a tattoo oh he has twist oh she has this like what do you gain what do you gain that's the lesson here i don't know if i said it right <laughs> Stay in your lane. Stop judging people. Stop leaving people alone. Okay? So, now, my third thing, a general habit or behavior is poor customer service. Let's just start with shopkeepers. <laughs> Listen, I know I cry. It can be very hard. Very, very hard. I don't want peace. I want problems, always. I know, and not everybody has good days all the time. But if you decide to run a business, okay, there's a certain etiquette that you you just have to go. You just, I'm sorry, you have to do it. <laughs> so if I enter your store, you can't be addressing me like you are doing me a favor. I saw this video of like this girl imitating like how cashiers or shopkeepers are. You ask them, oh, madam, please, do you have soup? I don't know. I can't find it. It's finished. I didn't do it. <laughs> do you know? Do you know about revenue or money? Like I don't understand. I get maybe they maybe they aren't being paid well. I don't know what it is, but it hurts. Okay, it hurts my feelings and. I don't want to talk about online stores because I feel like that should be a different video. But let me just see delivery dispatch riders. Oh gosh. Just taking you in circles all around the car. Ah, but ma, 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 you said American house. You said American house. So I went to Kaneshi. Is it not Kane? Eh? It's Legon someone to take this bite buy them a yam just a, a, a simple android put gps on it so that they can it's too much it's too much so i'm going to finish the rest offline it's gonna be very quick and then i'm gonna come back with a grand entrance so i don't know if it will transition but <laughs> to use this filter because there's no lighting so it wasn't accentuating the features but i did hear under eyebrow glimmer i had a little touch you know a little <laughs> so this is my first recreation i did a pretty decent job um it's raining like it's i mean the clouds have come over but i'll try and catch some light and attach like pictures of me filter this but 
comment and let me know if you love the look keep it to yourself if you hate it i don't want any constructive criticism i'm here to be praised <laughs> i don't want any of that comment and let me know what your favorite Ghanaian habit superstition or behavior is or what your least favorite is now repeat the four rules after me stop judging keep supporting improve your customer service and do not touch anything that doesn't belong to you especially money let's have a moment of silence for Antonio say that you're fine when you're not really fine but you just can't get into it because they would thank you guys so much again for watching don't forget to comment like and subscribe